Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back to the channel, y'all. This is the third time. Someone did not want this message to get out. If you have not yet, welcome, welcome to my channel. My name's Mickey. Welcome to all my new subscribers. Welcome to the ones that have not subscribed yet. Remember, there are 51 people that are subscribed and 41% of the people who are not. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. It's always appreciated with free support. Making it all make sense. Making it all make sense. Let's get back into the reading. This is the third time I'm over it. <laughs> y'all, don't forget to double check on things. Just make that all make sense. But, y'all, I'm getting, like, the person that you're broken from or there's a someone that you're broken up with betrayed your trust. Maybe someone tried to do love spells or spells on you unknowingly. And you broke up with them due to you maybe finding this out. You probably found out this person was doing love spells on you and had, you know, his own little couple of people, you know, that he be taking out of the recycling bin and put in front of him, making it all make sense. Um, I'm getting something like someone wanted a vacation to backfire for you, and it's not. I'm getting this person is watching you to see your next moves. This person that you were entangled with, that this person was in a relationship with you but then tell you that they was in a relationship with someone else maybe this is a lift driver maybe this is a, 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 a scammer a you know a person that'll take advantage of someone if they see the you know intent to do it making it all make sense feel um fell down got back up so i'm getting that you fell back down i mean you fell back down this person y'all i don't know why my words have been twisted like it's been backwards and forwards in a sense. So making it all make sense. Someone is entangled. Someone fell down in a situation but got back up. I'm getting that this person that you were entangled with, your emotions made you feel broken. But I'm getting like you coming up and coming out of this situation and not worried about this person. There's so many blessings coming for you and you didn't even realize it. But you had to go through this situation in order to come out on the other end blessed. And they got to watch your table be prepared in front of you. Making it all make sense. So, um, I'm getting something about someone took a gamble with you, y'all. Somebody fumbled a bag. This, vamp this energy vampire fumbled you. And this person fumbled you for someone. Like, remember, like, last year, like, a year and a half ago, I used to say, someone traded you in for Chuck E. Cheese coins and... You can't spend it nowhere but Chuck E. Cheese. Some kitty stuff. You was the gold. You was you was the bag. Making it all make sense. I'm getting that someone is happy. You're happy. This person's happy being entangled, having more than one lover. Maybe this person needs more than one flavor. Y'all, I know I can't share nobody I'm with. Moving forward. You are right. It's right here. And I'm right. You are going to travel too. That is right. Maybe you felt like you weren't going to be able to. Y'all, I still keep getting. Why do I get? Scam the scammer. Scam scammer pack. So this is, y'all. This person is, these people are disloyal. People are getting feedback from disloyal people. Maybe someone has an I or H, first and middle, last name. What else, spirit? This is a warning. These people are disloyal. This is a warning. Do not go on vacation with whoever these okay people is. Go by yourself and see how stuff works. I'm getting to maybe someone is entangled with someone that is the only one in the relationship with a car. I'm getting, um, maybe you didn't have a car at one point, and take the roles as they need to be flipped, y'all, making it all make sense. Remember, this is over 5,000 people, but I'm getting to, like, someone wanted to make delays. Didn't I say something about delays? You were the one that fell down, got back up. These people took a, a, a gamble on you, and now they're having delays. They're trying to figure out how they're going to pay and do, and, and, and do whatever they need to do to get back where they was. I'm getting, you're getting new friends as well. Maybe the old disloyal friends are, um, it was, 
was someone that called me. Maybe some type of some I'm getting to some type of disloyal ass friend or maybe some type of new friend, five, 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 or it's whatever. I'm getting like I may be right about a new friend trying to come in and be in your energy. And or there may be a situation where the old friends are out in, in the new friends in, like out with the old, in with the new. What else, spirit? Someone is open. Someone is open to what I'm saying, what you're saying, due to what you're saying is coming to pass. I'm getting like there is going to be some type of complete win for you in a slow delay and slow down for them because they're trying to take advantage of people that they feel, you know, is easy game or, oh, it's like taking candy from a baby. Like, who does that? Like, who really, like, I'm not. I don't do shit like that. I'd rather help people so they don't get taken advantage of. Something about a bony bitch, y'all. I'm getting something about a phony, disloyal itch. Y'all need to be, this is a warning. Maybe you're going to go on some type of vacation and randomly you're going to see them there. No, that wasn't by coincidence. Some type of communication is coming in within the next 24 hours. I'm getting high priestess. I'm getting something about a high priestess is going to go on a vacation. Maybe this is a well-needed vacation. What else, Spirit, do I need to see for the collective of Gemini's? Someone is going to get caught red-handed in a car. Someone ain't supposed to be in a car with someone. Maybe someone's going to get caught red-handed with this bony itch. You've been waiting for this. So, y'all, I'm getting this touched on. You've been waiting for someone to get caught, hand, caught red-handed in a situation and for you to be on a trip. I guarantee you I'm getting, like, when someone go on a trip, someone's going to get dealt with by the, ju by the judicial system. Someone's trying to find balance due to delays. Maybe you've been trying to find a job. Maybe you've been trying to find a job. And it's in, in with your health conditions, it's, it's been very compromising. Making it all make sense, trying to stop your progress. So the person that got caught red-handed doing weird stuff to you was trying or is trying to stop your project progress. Home is coming less than two weeks, so maybe someone's going to get a home in less than two weeks. Someone's trying to find balance after dealing with a lustful person. I'm getting someone's going to find a new friend in their city or be watchful of this new friend that you're going to befriend. This person is not the sharpest knife in the drawer, y'all. And this is the big fat truth that there's this is the big fat truth of this, and there's gonna be a big fat truth that there's gonna be some type of win. I'm getting something about a good job is coming to someone has been thinking about a good job, and this is the yes. So communication is coming in within the next 24 hours. So be aware, be like just thank God. I thank God. For him taking care of me while I don't, you know, why while, while I'm not employed with an actual nine to five. Maybe God is just telling me that I got you. This, you know, what I have for you is for you. And I know with my condition, like, y'all, I got to go to a two-hour meeting thing. I got a two-hour thing that I have to go to today. I think it's at, like, one o'clock. So I had wanted to hurry up and do this reading for y'all and get it put on so by the time it uploads by the time i'm doing whatever i'm doing i'm doing what i'm doing and y'all still got y'all matches while i'm moving accordingly so um y'all let's get into another oh yeah and then i gotta do a a visual uh uh guess with my financial aid so i can get back into college y'all to you know get into something i really want to do making it all make sense it just felt like there's so many damn delays and me doing it, and it's like they can't find my name, they can't find my classes, they can't do this. Oh, she's not gonna be in the office till the 15th. Like, making it all make sense. And then they gave me the wrong college number, so I had to go in and figure fix it. <sighs> Moving forward, someone is secluded, separation. Maybe someone's secluded, someone's in separation, someone's reflecting. I'm getting someone is reflecting. On a situation that came about. 
Someone got secrets, y'all. Someone's a psycho. Someone secluded from a psycho person. Mm. I'm getting someone got secrets. Maybe you separated yourself from this person and now someone's trying to be a psycho. Trying to look out your window, see if you're home and stuff. Maybe some, maybe someone needs to change the code or give another code because they know you too well. They can check your ring light. Making it all make sense. I'm getting um something about this situation. Maybe someone was in some type of domestic V situation or something dealing with the police station. Someone is separated due to a domestic V or a domestic A situation. Fake business. Maybe someone is at the police station due to fake business. This is the secret. The secret is there was some type of fake business. Someone, you, some type of way God separated you from whatever group of scammers or whatever type of group of people this was. Whatever happened, people going to the police station, people getting caught red handed. These folks are getting caught red handed, y'all. I'm getting like faith healing meditation in reverse. This, this psycho. Didn't want, didn't want to do none of this. It's all in reverse. They not praying. They not meditating. They not healing. And they want to come back to you and tell you that they ready to fix things. Fix what? You ready to fix you? You closing the cycle, y'all. Y'all closing the cycle after, after this secret comes out. I'm sorry. The cycle will be closed. This person going to be like... In spiritual jail or mental jail. Karmic ties. That is going to be broken. You ended those. You got tired of being with someone who keep playing with you. Or I'm getting, I had a dream that somebody uh, came into their friend room and asked could they touch them. And they was like, go ask your girlfriend. Someone is in an off and on, cold, detached, ghosted relationship. Y'all, my right ear is ringing y'all it's still ringing it's some good news coming being that you separated yourself and closed the cycle of this toxic karmic type it's blessings coming you ran from that situation when you ran, when I tell you, it's so many blessings coming towards you. It's too late. It's too late. They they, they, they going psycho and going crazy because it's too late. They can't be back in your energy. They ran out of time. You gave them too much time. I'm getting and they just pissed it away. Someone's trying to track, track you, being it is too late. This person's watching you. Somebody watching somebody. Maybe you have a, a maybe you uh, found out that you this person was having a baby, and that's another secret. And oh, this person um is starting to become psych. I guess something about some type of fake news. Maybe something about a fake pregnancy, DNA, something like that. But this person left you due to maybe a pregnancy or you finna have their baby. They didn't want that type of energy. I'm getting that for someone. But it is what it is. People got to protect themselves a little bit more. Somebody ran away from it and probably it was something fake. Or maybe someone ran away from someone. Maybe someone had a false pregnancy or a false uh pregnancy read something like that maybe you finding out maybe someone was sleeping with someone and there wouldn't be no 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 applicable way of there being a pregnancy if this person did not sleep with this person so i'm getting like gemini's you not going for that you too spiritual for this you see what this person is doing you see that this person is hot and cold this person sleeping with this person that person and this person you know, I'm getting to, like, there's going to be truth and discovery that's going to be illuminated. You're awakening from this truth, and this person that is divine masculine 
is trying to come back all like this, but they're the ones watching you. They trying to ask your travel to watch you, but it's like a board over you. They can't see anything. That's probably why you haven't been seeing any of your dreams like that. Making them all make sense. This person is phony. This person is a trickster. This person is a scammer. They cause illusions. They create this fairy tale life. It's a woman probably too. Maybe someone's lying about a pregnancy to keep somebody just for, so that they don't have a relationship with you or there's a delay in a relationship because someone lying about a pregnancy. Making it all make sense. Left you hanging. So, y'all, I'm getting Gemini's. This person left you hanging and that's why you ran away from this, this, this situation. I'm so tired. I'm hearing in my head, I'm so tired of people saying I'm my brother's keeper mother's keeper sister's keeper show me an action i don't give a damn if that shit written on you just because it's written in stone don't mean it's going being put into action making it all make sense fed up so gemini's you are fed up you got fed up you know you just secluded yourself from this person you got too many damn to do's to do anyway it's a round and round cycle. It's triggers and lessons with this divine masculine. This person is not who you think they are. They are a cycle. They cope with things like this. So you go on and you probably don't caught them in, you know, in their episodes before. I'm getting to like someone's going to try to send a love message, but you fed up. You fed up. You're tired. You're done. I'm getting this person has too many legal matters going on with you and other people that they're trying to keep secrets. Oh my God, it's the secrets for me. These secrets be secreting. Love child. So y'all, I'm getting someone's trying to cope due to a love child. Someone wasn't being honest. Someone's being phony, causing illusions. Maybe someone lied and said that they didn't get someone pregnant, but they really did. And that shit is coming out. Someone is, it probably was due to someone drinking with this toxic lifestyle now someone's trying to come back with a message of love y'all look i tell people right now i don't know who's looking at me who's watching i have elevated in my spirituality it's been since i can say 2017 when i got my first deck of tarot cards i tell everybody look at the end of the day people are not worthy to be around you until they show you in action and i'm gonna tell y'all that like straight up people are not gonna be honest with you and tell you and then when you tell, I'm telling you, when you tell them what you see and what this is, they get defensive. Be aware of that defensiveness. Making it all make sense. You rejected this person. You don't have time for this. You rejected this person when you found out about a love child. And then two, if you're in LGBT community relationship, they hot and cold. They either like women, don't like women, want to be with men, however the situation may be. And that can hurt and break someone because when you are open to sleeping with a man and a woman, regardless of the relationship work with a woman, regardless of the relationship work with a man, you still have double the options of someone who's just dealing with one status. Someone that just deals with women. Or someone that just deals with men. But you be dealing with men and women. It's like, and then your emotions can go crazy all types of way because you can go either way. And it's not safe. I like being with someone that's staying on one side. We're not choosing side. We're not choosing no middle ground. No, we over here or we over here. We either, you know, straight. We're over here. And, you know, in our own energy, loving ourselves, loving men that love women or women that love men or are you over there lbgt community plus it's all welcome over here but don't lie to no one because you feel the love and you want that but you're not in that status make it all make sense mm. i love you this person gonna come around say they love you they acted like they love you someone gonna try to come around and make some type of offer y'all don't take it they're they're lying this is a Jezebel, or they have one. It's a round and round circle, or they always got a side Jezebel waiting for a position. <laughs> shake and y'all. Something finna shake y'all. Something finna shake up. This secret finna shake up a whole lot of households. <laughs> someone was doing love spells, y'all. You ran when you felt like someone was doing love spells on you, because I feel like when love spells be reversed back to center, they go crazy. They go crazy, they go crazy, they go crazy. Making it all make sense. Someone had reckless love, reckless sex that separated y'all and did. And did. Making it all make sense. They feeling like shit because they ain't got you now. All over this person. Lust. Massive. 
They have a massive regrets. They have legal issues now. You and them probably got legal issues. Everything being spilled on the table, y'all. This person is fucked up over you, y'all. This person don't know what to do. What else, spirit? Someone's trying to pop the question. Or maybe someone's in a relationship with someone. And then someone's trying to pop the question to someone else. Y'all, it's not going to work. Don't do it. If it's the relationship is already toxic, why add something that you think going to make your relationship grow when it's already messed up? Making it all make sense. Someone's in shame and guilt due to reckless sex, reckless love, y'all. Y'all better stay away from that shit, y'all. Y'all going to be around here hurt. Y'all going to be in a situation where y'all think that a person is really going to be here for you, but they really in it for a conditional. They're not in it just to love you. They're in it to see what you have going on and how they can be a part and how they can scheme and scam you out of your draws, your money, you know, your a place. You know, people, boy, look, people will sleep with you for just a place to stay. I'm telling you that right now. I had a dream, too, that someone ended up moving in with you or something like that. It's something like that. You end up moving in with somebody. I don't know, making it all make sense. Let's get into the mystic red rose oracle and then after this i'm gonna um post this i'm trying to figure out what are good times y'all let me know what are good times even though i do from six to six what would be other times like within that six to six because sometimes i'll have one on at six sometimes i'll have one on at 10 sometimes i'll have one on at 12 three four or six it's just all when i get the energy or something is telling me like do this reading right now so, let me see what I need to see. Let me do this quick because I know I got like maybe four or five minutes until it goes into another video. I need to charge up my tablet. i just been trying to do so much, y'all, to restart my life back over. Getting my kids in school. Glad I was able to do that last year. Getting to our place. Glad I was able to do that in December. You know, being able to get a part-time job or getting something that's going to be able to help me pay half of my, you know, my expenses so that the other half is going to be taken care of until... You know, Social Security, of course, I do reading, so that's why I have readings out, candles out, you know, anything that I can do to help me. You know, I even send baked goods, you feel me, and you'll get it in two days, making it all make sense. I'm getting something about a union, a marriage, soul connection, everlasting love, devotion. Y'all, this has something to do with someone in your marriage or maybe someone's competing with you maybe someone's married too and they trying to compete with you compete with you with trips or this is someone just kind of trying to compete with you with a soulmate or maybe this person that you're in a relationship with is competing with you and y'all supposed to be working together i'm getting like whoever is married someone's competing with another woman whoever you're in a relationship with y'all you have unconditional love. You have self-love, wholeness, affection, attractiveness. Um, but I'm getting like this person is selfish. This person has so much selfishness in this relationship. This person has old, outdated thinking. Oh, if I bring home the money, I can do what I want. If I pay the, the bills, but no, it's been 50-50 what I've been saying. The wife and the husband have been going to work, but then they feel like regardless of the relationship, they feel like even though you go to work, even though you do pay half or anything like that, they feel like at the end of the day, they feel like you should um, be able to do everything a woman does and he can just go out and do what he don't, do what he want to do and you can't. And it's like a, I can do what you want, you do what you don't. Something like that, y'all. I'm getting that. It's like a Drake lyric, if y'all can put it at the bottom. Someone is learning. Someone is learning from how people think they're outdated thinking you're learning from a soulmate you learning that at the end of the day it, it don't really just work like that like it's, it's all in the, in the dynamic of the relationship like if a man can take care of his business and take care of his woman while a woman has her business on the side and still taking care of, you know what family stuff vacations and he's paying bills and he contributes y'all doing this together this is a team someone ain't working as a team I'm getting Cupid's arrow. Someone needs to have faith. There is going to be some type of love relation to come to you after a selfish one. Maybe someone even has been in a situation where they was with someone and they didn't realize how they was. But this real person is coming, making it all make sense. Karmic relationships. 
I'm getting something about 2454. So I'm not sure how that makes sense or someone's address is that. Well, someone is resenting someone because of a karmic relationship, because of someone's outdated thinking. Y'all, oh, someone cheating and is. Last card, spirit. Last card. I'm getting y'all that you're ascending. I'm getting whatever trips that you think that you was never finna get, whatever relationship that you thought that you was never finna have, y'all, is coming. And whoever was trying to stop that, when I say you ain't got nothing to worry about, you ain't got nothing like a twin flame or someone that had situations just like you that you had going on, and y'all be able to grow together, form something together, y'all. But if y'all trying to get a reading, y'all, it is the weekend, $33.33. Um, that's for everybody. If you're trying to get on my members only, remember we get cutoffs and all of that. Go over there, readings, you know, I even give away free stuff. But until the next one, y'all, peace, love, prosperity, and protection.